Hey guys, welcome back to another quick how to. So today I'll be teaching you on how you can set up a payment method on Wix. So first, you just have to open your web browser and then visit the Wix website. So you just have to type out wix.com and then make sure to log in to your account. And then now that you have logged into your account, all you have to do is to click on the old sites and select the site that you want to add a payment method. So for example, this one, so you just have to select an edit site. And then you just have to wait for a few seconds. Then now that you're here on your dashboard, and if you did not set up a payment method, you'd be able to see these options right here. Okay, so you'd be able to see different options. And then right here, you just have to click on the set up payment methods. And you can also connect the custom domain if you want to. So just click on this one right here. So this button at your right side of the screen. Okay, you set up payments. And then once you've done that, you just have to wait for a few seconds and then you'll be able to see this page. And here you just have to select your country. And if this is not your country, so you can just go ahead and click on change. You'd be able to change it. And then just click on confirm. So here you'd be able to see two options. You've got PayPal and you have manual payments. Now, if you want to add more payment methods right here, and let's try to go to see more payment options. So when you click on this one, you'll be able to see more payment options. You've got hit pay, dragon pay, online payments by send debt, and then payment wall. So if you want any of these payment options, you just click on connect. But now let's go back right here and then change the country. So changing the country of your website will give you different options. I mean, payment options that you can choose from. So see, for example, I want to change my country to Australia. Okay. So for example, this one, then click on choose. Then after that, you'd be able to see that there is another option for you to how you can accept payments. So for example, you want to use this one. So you've got the Visa, you've got MasterCard and different cards that you can use to receive the payments. So if you want to use this one, all you have to do is to click on the connect options at your right side of your screen. So this button right here. So you just have to click on it. And once you've done that, you've got here the restrictions that you have to follow. This is to make sure that they connect your right provider, review the restricted list, and answer questions below. So you've got other contents, alcohol as the main product. Right here, you have also the binary options, cryptocurrencies, CBD. So you have to learn more about selling CBD on your site, financial products and services, firearms and weapons, gambling, lotteries, school games, and then medical devices, so prescription only and regulated medical devices, and also nutraceuticals prescriptions only. So you have tobacco and e-cigarettes right here. So be sure to go over to the full list of VIX payments, prohibited products and services. So you will not receive money if you sell these products or services with VIX payments. So right here, do you sell any of the prohibited products or services? So make sure you click on the no, I do not, and then continue connecting to Wix payments, okay? So after clicking on the no, I do not, you just have to click on accept and continue. Okay, so you just click on this button right here. Then once you've done that, you just have to wait for a few seconds. And of course, if you really wanted to use this type of payment options, you have to upgrade to a plan. But before that, let me just show you right here the features of this payment options. So just click on the manage option at the top. So scroll down and then click on the manage. Okay, so right here, you just have to toggle the switch on for this one. But before we can toggle the switch, we have to subscribe to a plan, okay? But before that, let me just show you the other things right here. So you can also toggle the switch on for the Apple Pay. So you can accept payments via this kind of payment method. And then you also have the Google Play. So you just have to toggle the switch on as well. And also the online bank transfer, you just have to toggle the switch on. So now let's talk about the different plans that you can actually subscribe to when you want to get this payment method. So right here, you just have to click on the upgrade option. Okay, so this one, and then you'd be redirected 
to this page where you can actually see the different plans so here the business and e-commerce plans you have the business vip and right here at the bottom you'd be able to see what these plans has to offer you have accept payments plans securing payments so you've got the business unlimited and you have the business basics so so the prices of the plans will depend on the features that the plan has to offer so you have got right here storage space the lead capture forms a field perform customized reports customer care so you have to select the plan that you think you need for your business okay so when you go back at the top and then click on the website plan so you've got also right here different plans that you can subscribe to so let's go back right here so if you decided to uh, subscribe to one of their plans just click on select and then you just have it to type out your payment information and all of the things that you need in order for you to get these plans okay so right here let's go back to the wix website and then i just click on complete setup and then once you've done that right here you'd be able to see the tell us about your business section okay so let's go back at the top and let me discuss it to you so the first one is you have to select your business type so right here you've got different options so you just have to select what business type do you have and then when you scroll down you'll be able to see here the personal details so you have to make sure to type out all of the exact details to prevent um delays of the account verification so first is you have to type out your first and your middle name and then for the second section you have to type out your last name and then select the date of your birth so next one is to upload your photo id it is to verify who you are and if the info shown in your order doesn't match the info you entered above so they won't be able to approve your account so you have to make sure that all of the details are all correct okay and then the next one is the address so you can use your home address if you don't have a business address yet so here you have to type out your house number then the next one is a street name so there are examples in the box so you just have to follow it and then the city and of course the postal code and after that your business phone number of course this is one of the very important things that you should not forget okay so the next one is the business description so tell us what kind of products or services you offer to your site you've got your um, doing business business name you've got the industry and then of course the description of the products or services you offer then your bank account details so you have here your high plan you just have to tap it out then you have to confirm that and then after that you have the bank statement or document you just have to upload the bank statement so we only use the bank statement to verify the bank account and send your money and the info shown in the blank statement doesn't match the info you entered above so they would be able to approve your account now here are the terms and conditions so wix payment services are provided by wix.com so you just have to click on this box right here to accept the terms and conditions and then after that you just have to click on submit of course before you can click on the submit you have to make sure that you have fill out all of the needed information from the very beginning to the end okay so the next one is you can actually go ahead and try to connect to different payment methods so right here go to the paypal and then the manual payments so first the paypal is you just have to click on connect and then here to connect your paypal account you have to enter your paypal account email in the form below click connect and you'll be directed to paypal so you just have to follow the instructions and click plug in and then your paypal account will be connected to your wix account so when you scroll down you have to type out right here email address and then after that you just have to click on connect and then type out your password you just have to fill out all of the needed information and you'd be able to connect your paypal account here in the payment method now let's go back and try to explore the manual payments so you just have to click on connect and then right here you just have to select one of the following payment types so you've got manual payment cash payment offline payment and then cash on delivery so for example cash on delivery right here you have to let customers know how to pay so basically you have to type out right here the detailed instructions for your customers to pay properly or pay correctly to ensure that you'll receive the money and after that you just have to click on connect and once you've done that, the kind of payment methods will be added to your website. 
So those are the things that you should know in order for you to add payment methods on Wix. Okay, so that's a wrap. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more quick how-to videos next time. Adios!